What's going on everybody? Back with another mod tutorial and this time it will be on the More Creatures mod. Um, I'm sure most all, mostly all of you know what this mod is. It's one of the most popular mods that is out there for Minecraft right now. But if you don't know what it is, I'm going to go ahead and show you anyways. Um, I believe there are also a few extra mobs since the last time I showed you guys this mod. So we're going to check that out. Uh, let me turn down the volume. Alright. So we can see over here we got some uh, foxes. There's a bear, a horse, a turtle. I think the turtle is new since the last time I reviewed this mod. Uh, there was a mouse over here somewhere. Let me find the mouse real fast. If I can. I hear it, but I don't see it. Where is the mouse at? Uh, you can see down there, those are some sharks. Uh, here's the mouse. There's another turtle down there. There was a cat around here, but I think it took off. I don't know where it went. So I'm going to go ahead and walk back this way and see if we can find at least one more mob that this adds. There were some birds around here too. I don't know what happened to them. Uh, here's another fox over here. What's that up there? I believe that's a villager that I spawned a long time ago and it's still here. Oh, that does sound like it hurt. Uh, here's a bird. Oh, there it goes. wonder if that cat is still around here. Okay, I'm having difficulties getting up. Here we go. Sorry for this little bit of lag that I'm getting right now. I'm working on keeping it down. Looks like there's a lion over there. Let's go check this out and then we will go ahead and stop the vid. No, it was not a lion. <laughs> it was another fox. Here's a duck. So that's pretty much it. It's just the um, just the gist of the mod. A uh, little bit of the mobs it adds. There are plenty more mobs. If I go ahead and do this to spawn list you can see that it adds a a boar a bear a duck a big cat a horse an ogre a fire ogre a cave ogre a let me find a dolphin a shark egg a shark a werewolf a kitty a fishy a mushroom no that's that's already in there um, a fishy egg a wrath, a polar bear, a deer, a fox. I want to see what a deer looks like, so I'm going to do spawn deer. Why is that still staying up there? That's creepy sounding. So here's the deer. Yeah, that's really creepy sounding. Okay, so when I when I hit it, it started bucking around. <laughs> Alright, so yeah. I'm going to go ahead and cut it here. Because I'm taking too long on uh, showing you guys this. So go ahead and save and quit to title. Close down Minecraft. And now I need to clean out my Minecraft jar. After I do that, I'll be back and I'll show you how to install this. Alright, so what you're going to need is either WinRAR or 7-Zip or any kind of archiving program, really. Um, whatever you prefer to use when it comes to an archiving program. I will be using WinRAR in this tutorial. And then you're going to need to download AudioMod, ModLoader, Custom Mob Spawner, GUI API, and Dr. Sharks, I think is how you say it, Mo Creatures. Um, so you're going to have to download five different things to actually get this mod to work. I know that's kind of a lot of stuff, but it's what you got to do. So, first off, for the Mo Creatures. To download this, you're gonna go ahead and scroll down past all that stuff and go ahead and click on Mo Creatures Mod 
version 3.0.0.zip and it'll take you to an ad fly and you just wait five seconds and up in the top right hand corner it'll say skip ad and then you click on that and it'll take you to a media fire and you just go ahead and click on download now for audio mod and mod loader they'll both be on this page um, so you just go ahead and scroll down past all this until you see mod loader beta mod loader 1.0.0 and you can either download adfly or direct uh, whichever you prefer to do I tend to usually do direct because um, adfly usually messes up for me sometimes so after you download mod loader just scroll down a little bit more until you see audio mod and again download adfly or direct whichever you prefer to do so after you download audio mod mod loader you come to this page and this will be the cu the custom mob spawner and go ahead and click on custom mob spawner version 1.3 because this is the version that will work for minecraft 1.0 and again it'll take you to an ad fly up in the top right hand corner again wait four seconds or five seconds and it'll say skip ad go ahead and click on that and again it'll take you to a media fire and you just click on download now for GUI API um, I'll put the link in the description for this page and you're just going to scroll down to where it says download mod and just click on that and it'll download it so yeah very simple on downloading all that stuff I know it is kind of a lot of stuff to download but that's what you need to install this so now to install this after you've downloaded everything you can go ahead and come over to start type in percent app data percent just like this down here and then you can go ahead and go into your roaming, your dot Minecraft, go into your bin, left click your Minecraft jar, then right click it to open with WinRAR or 7-Zip, whichever, whatever you're using. Now take your bin folder and we're going to go ahead and minimize that because we're going to come back to it later. Drag your Minecraft jar to the side, open up audio mod, highlight all the files and drag them into your Minecraft jar, click OK. Go ahead and close audio mod. Open up a mod loader. Highlight all these class files and drag them into your Minecraft jar. Click OK. Go ahead and close the mod loader. Open up custom mob spawner. Click on the first class file. Hold shift and click on the last class file. Um, if you do this, it will highlight just these three class files because we don't want to put the readme text into your Minecraft jar. So when you highlight those three, go ahead and drag them into your Minecraft jar click OK and go ahead and close custom mob spawner open up GUI API click on the DE folder hold shift scroll all the way down while holding shift and click on the widget text dot class so you highlight all the files within there and drag them into your Minecraft jar click OK go ahead and close GUI API now we're going to go over into your Minecraft jar right click made inf and do delete files hit yes always delete meta inf if you don't delete that it'll stop minecraft from working so now you're done with your minecraft jar so we can go ahead and close that now you should have minimized your uh, bin folder so bring that back up and go ahead and hit back so we're back in the dot minecraft folder where it shows your bin and your resources and all that stuff now go ahead and open up mod, uh, mo creatures go ahead and click on mods hold shift and click on resources so you highlight those two folders and drag them into your dot minecraft folder click yes and there you go that is it you are done installing mo creatures so that's pretty much it uh, it's quite a bit of steps to do but hopefully it wasn't too hard for you guys and i hope this video helped you guys out so that's it thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time